is Texans Talk with Texans. The unofficial official Texans pregame show. With NFL Pro Bowler wannabe Joe Cool the Greaser. And also NFL Pro Bowler wannabe Nick Rogers. And now it's Texans Talk with Texans. And now here are your hosts Joe Cool the Greaser and Nick Rogers. Hey man, you got, got that good look going on, man. What's up with the hat and glasses? Well, I'm trying to hide out because, you know, being a Texans fan is kind of... Scary looking, huh? <laughs> scary. It, it's it's hard to be a Texans fan right now, okay? With all the garbage that's going around. Yeah, yeah, me too. Achoo! What was that? Oh, this is me, man. It's contagious! <laughs> Okay, uh, and from that, that's the end of our show. That was the stupidest thing I ever heard. So, Nick, it's obvious we're both disappointed. Yeah, man. Can't believe it. Can you believe it? No, I can't believe it. Um, Texans are three and four. Uh, it should be that way, man. It just it no, should they be should, they should be, no, they should be like seven and oh, right? I say about five and two. Five and two? Yeah, okay, I say about five and two. You're a realist, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, that, that's cool. Um, this well, is about what happened Monday night. Uh, Monday night football. Man, they had, the Texans had the Pittsburgh from the start for the first half. The second half, it was a mental collapse. Look, in the National Football League, you can't win those games like that. You just can't, period. Okay, well, let's, let's talk about the first quarter. Uh, the, first, the first quarter of the Texans... Um, I can barely remember the game, okay? But I remember the first quarter of the Texans, uh, they made a touchdown, and I was like, okay, the Texans are starting to roll a little bit, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, maybe the, the uh, you know, maybe this is a, a trend that will keep on, you know, yeah. going. Mm -hmm. And then in the second quarter, was there some fumbles, interceptions, what, what was going on? Uh, I'll, wait, look, this is the thing. It looked like the Texans were kind of rolling, but they were doing like, just, uh, just like they were they were making they were making many errors. Well, look, a couple plays that they had. The, uh, the fumble was one by Arian Foster. Okay. It, what was supposed to be, where Arian, he, he was down by contact, and it was just the ball came out. That was it. But the replay showed later on that he actually lost the ball. And his feet or his leg didn't touch the ground. Therefore, it was a live ball. So one of the Pittsburgh's uh, Steelers uh, to piss him in recovered it. Okay. Well, l l this is what I remember. Okay, because that was a it was a rough. It night. start it started from there. It was a rough night. Okay. Uh huh. Um, didn't the the Texans like have two good uh, where they had uh, what is it called? Um, I'm, I'm like blank. They had good field advantage. Uh, yeah, uh, good field position. Foot, field position yeah, but they, where, but they went three they, and out. And, and and look, they had field position where I was like, okay, they're 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 um, you know on their side of uh, 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 on the other side of the ball, right? Look, um, excuse me, I think I drank too much beer. Yeah, I but, feel you, man. Uh, but basically, on those two possessions that they had. And they were like deep in their own territory. Mm -hmm. uh, I was thinking that you know, let's let's get a touchdown, yeah, at least exactly. one of them. Yeah. And what happened? They got one field goal, and I was like, and I was I was, a, I, was yeah. a little, I got a little nervous yeah. after that. I was happy too. I mean, I mean, you should have been a touchdown, not a field goal, because cause you know. But I was I was a little bit satisfied because it was ten nothing, and then I I'm not sure what happened. I don't know the Texans 
could have scored another touchdown, but they got another field goal. Okay, I don't, and then the collapse, the the twenty four unanswered points in the second quarter. I mean, I don't know what the hell happened. Yeah, it was just I, it was mental. It's overall just mental mistakes. Mental? Well, yeah. Uh, I don't know if it was a punt return or a kickoff return. Uh, who was the guy that dropped the ball? He dropped it, and then he picked it back up, and. Uh, yeah, and, and and then that was all, all all she wrote from there, that point on. Like one of my buddies said, he said when, whenever he watched the game, he, it looked like it wasn't real to him. It looked like a cartoon, like, you know, the like ball that, is like slippery like a banana and everybody's trying to grab it. Yeah. And I don't know, I didn't take my high blood pressure pills that day. <laughs> and my, I needed to take some pills that day because I was like, oh, God dang. What the hell's going on, you know? Yeah. And um, by the end of the quarter, it was, uh, what was it? It was like, by the end of the second quarter, it was 24 to 13. And I was like, God dang, how the hell did this crap happen, you know? It's like, how did it happen, right? Yeah, 24 unanswered points. Mm -hmm. So then we go to the third quarter. In the third quarter, I was in bed, you know, trying to recover, you know? Yeah, that, that, uh, and getting ready for work. Yeah, that fourth quarter there. And again, no, I said third quarter. Oh, I'm sorry, third quarter. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> which, which is, which is uh, fine. Why you skipped over the third quarter because <laughs> nobody did nothing. It was zero zero in yeah, third quarter, right. according to my stats, because I yeah. didn't watch the game uh, after right. the second quarter because I was, I was punching holes in the holes in the wall. Um, I wish you were here that day so I could punch you in the face. You know. Oh yeah, that's so hot. That's so. Okay, <laughs> cut the, edit that out, Joe. Okay, because that was the stupidest thing we ever seen. All right, ready? One, two, three, go. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so the third quarter. I mean, did it? What was it to you? It was, to me, it didn't it was, matter. It was, it was just boring. Day. It was just three and out overall. Uh, on the text. Bunch of three and outs. Yeah, three and outs, three and outs overall. Nothing was going on. The offense sputtered. And Fitzpatrick was ha having an unsuccessful game that quarter overall. Now, now let's jump into the fourth, fourth quarter, fourth and final quarter. That's where the Texans still had still had a chance. Even even though they blew they blew the lead, but something went wrong again. The metal turnovers just can't do that in the National Football League. Met you, you metal cannot. turnovers. That's what. You said metal turnovers or metal? No, that's all. Oh, okay. Don't correct me. Wow. So, just when they thought they had a chance to pull the game out, basically. Out of their keisters? Yeah, no. <laughs> Another. We can't talk like that. No, hold on. This hold is on. a kid show. <laughs> Let's keep this PG, all right? PG? Yeah. So. We'll keep it PG, but guess what? The Texans need to make it rated R, all right? Yeah, you're right. Start getting right. butt naked on these damn teams and beat the hell out of them. Exactly. I don't know what that means, but, you know. Yeah. Anyways, so the fourth quarter, it didn't matter. The Texans only scored 10 points. Uh, it, it, it just didn't matter. What, no, it didn't. And that fumble by DeAndre Hopkins didn't help any whatsoever. So that's kind of... So the Texans fade for the win. Now they're at three or four. Now they have to win throughout the, that's the season. They have to be undefeated. You you say to make it to the playoffs. Basically, yes. Damn, that's what what would that be? Twelve and four. God damn, that's a pretty good record to go undefeated. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Well, they're not gonna go undefeated. Okay, I'll tell you that right now. Okay. All right. Well, do you think they're gonna go undefeated? I was. Yes. Yes? Yes. Wow. Okay. Yes. Um, I can be, they're I going can, against the Mighty Titans to, the today, mighty, right? They're not that mighty. No, 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 no. Well, I say that sarcastically. Yes, okay. yes, but... The Mighty look, Two and Five Titans. Look, I say the Texans, what they got to do is take care of business on the road. Yeah. Period. This is our segment where callers call in their concerns, their problems, or whatever, their bitches, their nags about the Texans, okay? <laughs> And I understand if people are mad, upset at the Texans, because right now... That's how we I'm, feel. It's in the heart. Yeah, Nick, 
Even though he doesn't have a heart, he's soulless. <laughs> but the J-O-E does have a heart. Anyways, uh, you can take this first call. I'm going to go uh, do a pit stop real quick. All right, man. All right. I got this. Uh, huh? Oh, this is Texas Talk. Oh, this is Texas Talk. Oh, I call the wrong place. Oh, this is Texas Talk or Texas Talk or something like that. This is Texas Talk. How you doing? I'm just here. I'm just bored. Bored? Why are you bored? Yeah. My boy is taking stuff right now. Oh, yeah? Yeah. They've been doing better. It's they've been just playing and just stop being whipped and and let everybody pump them out like they've been doing. You're probably right. I mean, they took one game, but they just sat there and laid down and let them let other teams just walk all over. Excuse me, what's your name again? Uh, Cassandra. Cassandra, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I'm glad for your concern, Cassandra. Uh, go get a life and order some pizza somewhere else, all right? <laughs> Hello? Oh, she hung up on me. Oh, wow. You were mean to her, Nick. I was? Nah, I didn't change the channel. We got another caller online. Go ahead, caller. <laughs> Well, it's about time y'all answer the phone. I'm real getting ready to hang up. Man, what's yeah. up with the females uh, calling our show today? Yeah, what's up with that? Y'all should be happy. Maybe we're the only ones watching your show. Anyway, in my response to your previous callers, uh -huh. my Texans do not stop. They just having a hard time, that's all. Okay, yeah. Ride or die. Ride or die. Hey, like she that. sounds cute. <laughs> what? Too cute for you, mofo. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name again, caller? Don't worry about my name. <laughs> okay. I don't need a name. All you need to know is my Texans don't suck. Okay. There you go. He say it's hard to be a fan right now. Yeah. You ain't no fan then. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Yeah, good spirit. You ain't no fan. You need to get off the show. You need to bring back Mr. Carter or John Wayne, Sadie, whatever. I don't know. He's kind of cute. I think I like his beard, too. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, yeah? <laughs> wow. Yeah. He seems like he knows what he's talking about. We need some more predictions from here. All right. Um... That's all I gotta say. My Texans don't suck. Ryan dies. You don't like what's going on, and you don't support them. Then I'll have my son sue y'all. Okay. Oh, so like I guess her son's a lawyer. You don't want. Yeah. You don't want to meet him. All right, get out of here, guys. <laughs> Another loser chick. <laughs> Women these days, huh? Yeah. Women. I mean, what the heck. <laughs> Hello. Hi, uh, this is John Wayne Carter. Uh, y'all had me left uh, last week, and I was y'all special guest. Um, I actually don't appreciate what you said about me. Uh, I, I gave I gave y'all great insight, and I probably gave y'all one of the greatest shows y'all have had. Hello. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Well, I guess you don't have nothing to say. No, I, no, actually. Look, John Wayne, if that is your real name, do you, do you have an NFL education like I do? Because I got NFL knowledge, and you don't. That's why I said what I say, okay? Let me, let me tell you something, John Wayne. I got years on you. I know the future. You can't tell me what the future is, all right? So as far as what's going to go down for tomorrow's game, we're going to pull out a win and start winning these games. Got nothing to do with... with the Demonati, the Shadamas, whatsoever. By the way, which you're not. So now you know. Either you be with my team or against my team. Alright? <laughs> well, that, that, that's funny of you to say that. Uh, whenever all the signs are pointing to Illuminati, <laughs> Illuminati, Illuminati. And uh, it, it's just a shame that uh, you guys just, I, I, I don't know, you don't see the flat picture. I don't well, really know. Well. 
you see it to believe it and you see your heart and your heart hey because this, this is song it's an old song and it goes like this you get the touch and you get the power there you go yeah, I don't know what that's about. <laughs> uh, you know, uh, I, I think uh, John has a good show. Uh, maybe replace you, Nick. Uh, Joe Cool, he, 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 you know, put something in his name, Joe Cool. So, uh, yeah, I guess I'll give you all kinds of call back, uh, whatever, you know. Uh, I, I want the Texans to win, but uh, uh, they, they haven't made that blood sacrifice that, you know. And you're right. I give you props for that. I, you're right. But you know. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm sorry. Uh, um, um, yeah, the audience back. Yeah, I'm sorry. The audience is just uh, just too overwhelming. They don't know what's going on. So excuse the audience. It was between you and me, I think we're on the same page. I understand where you're coming from. You're a pretty alright guy. I'd like to have you on my team, man. If it's possible. No, the you just a kid, I gotta be gone. Peace. That's John Wade Carter, ladies and gentlemen. Mas puto! Yes. Color. Hey, uh, this is Richard Henry. And uh, I just want to call. Uh, I like your show. I think it's entertaining, informative. But me, uh, you sound like a dumbass. I mean, you went to NFL college or what? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I graduated. Did. Yes, I did. I got my degree in the NFL, National Football League. Joe Cool, did you go to the NFL college? He has no education. Sorry. No, I take that back. Yes, he does. I'm sorry. I am. Oh, me? Yeah. No, him. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now it's her day. I'm going to go down there and put your teeth down your throat. He's very upset, folks. Don't mind. Pay no attention. Play that one too many, folks. Any, anyway, what, what I got to say to Joe Cool is, Nate, you're acting like an ass right now. Uh, a bitch, I guess. Uh, Joe Cool, I think the Texas, you have what it takes to, to be the, the, the lowest times, but, you know, uh, the, the schedule is kind of soft, and uh, 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 they're going to beat. I, I think they're going to be all right and make it, you know, co-star for the playoffs. You're probably right. It, it, it's smooth but bumpy, though. I guess Carter just left. Next. Thanks for calling the show. This is uh, Texans Talk with Texans. Uh, Martin, you're on the air. Troll! Hello. Hey. What's up, Troll? How you been? Troll? Oh, is that Shrek? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's Shrek. That's Shrek, you bitch, baby. What's going on, Shrek? Uh, not, not much. Evil, evil. Troll. Am I on the show for real? Yeah, you're on J live from JST <laughs> Studios. Studios. <laughs> All right. What? Y'all got some questions for me or what? You well, know, basically, yeah. Alright, shoot. Alright, man, so how do you feel about tomorrow's uh, game? Wait, I thought you told me it was a bye week. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not stuck on that, yeah, dude. Up, you told me that it was I a bye week, and that's for that reason, because I trusted you. I <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I didn't prepare for the game, because you said we had a bye week, so <laughs> I'm not even trying to, like, you know. Get informed about what's going on in this bye week. It's not a bye week. I messed so up. So you lied. <laughs> that is true. Hey, up. but I, I'm in the middle of a, a poker game as we speak. Oh, uh, since so you're talking mess to me, you're probably not losing all that money then. Okay, but who's playing? It doesn't matter. <laughs> huh? Tennessee, Tennessee Titans. Oh, Tennessee Titans? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm never going to win that one, but it's going to be a low-scoring game because Houston can't score, yeah. but the defense is going to do well, yeah. so it's going to be a 7-3 victory. <laughs> yes, you heard it. 7-3. That's pretty good. 7-3 uh, uh, from Martin Roscoe. That's the prediction. All right.
Uh, all right, man. Uh, no, but look, I, I really do appreciate the call. Uh, <laughs> I thought you, you know, called us. Yeah, you called, called us. us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah I called in. <laughs> yeah, so what's up with that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, I'm in a good position, but uh, I'm glad you guys called, and I'm glad I, I was able to input my input on the Houston Texas victory tomorrow, of seven to three. Uh, all right, so that's yeah, a nice, that's a nice prediction. I like uh, it. And so, if you come out with your cards and you don't have the cards, but you didn't throw out an ace, hey man. English, motherfucker. <laughs> hey, I'm just saying, you know, if you got cards that are good, throw them down. If you don't, shit, it ain't good, homie. It's just not good for the pot. <laughs> All right, man. All right, guys. Well, I gotta let you go. Thanks for John okay. uh, calling in. All right. All right. Thanks for the call. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> so, so five, five keys and beat the time. Number one. Number one. You start it, you finish. That means once. <laughs> it's like I started and I finished this. <laughs> once the Texans start on the field, control the clock, the time of possession, overall period. That's start. number one. That's number one. That's Execute. Execute plays on both sides of the ball, the offense and defense. Number three. Again, I cannot say I stress this enough. No turnovers. Number four. Special teams and the coaching has to make better play calls to the quarterback. And also, the offensive line got to hold a line. Period. And five, last but not least, just win. I think that concludes our show. All right. This, guys, let's get the win, all right? That's just bottom line. All the, whatever is going on right now, let's get the W, guys, all right? Let's get this win so we can get us. Free slushy. Free, free slushy. On Tuesday. All On right. Tuesday. All right, folks. Please. On Thursday. <laughs> Anyways, this has been the, uh, what did I call it? Official, unofficial pregame show of the Texans. We'll see y'all next week when we face the Eagles. Let it go. Peace. Let's see how it just...